In tournament chess, you you have to sit at a certain posture. You can't talk no smack. Mm -hmm. It's quiet. Shut up. Be respectful. Now, he don't do none of that. It's <laughs> free fall, man. Now watch. Let's go. Chess playoffs. It's getting you. You ready? Let's go. Let's go. Welcome to Union Square, where New York's best chess players can be found year-round, playing everyone from children to grandmasters. We spent a day on the streets with chess player TC to see what this life is all about. Hey, good morning. This is TC. He's been playing chess in the park for seven years, but has been playing the game since he was seven years old. He's the first one out here and the last to leave seven days a week. All I know is I opened up my present at Christmas morning and it was a chess set and I went crazy. Why did your parents get you a chess set? I have no idea. My mother and my father don't even know anything about chess. What fascinated me about it is that every time I saw this game, adults had it. Where would you see them playing? In the parks. New York City chess players have a long and fabled history. They're out here hustling, playing chess every single day, and they have been for decades. They've been challenged by grandmasters. They've been featured in Hollywood movies. And they've played hundreds of thousands of people from all around the world. Originally, the best players went to Washington Square Park. But these days, more and more players come here to Union Square. Street chess is all about speed, trash talk, and if you have a good teacher, learning the game. Before chess, TC was working for the parks department. But on a long vacation, he decided to see what it'd be like to play in the park. And he was hooked to the game and the money. 23 days vacation time. I took those 23 days, matched up my check. I was in the wrong business. You have made up to $9,000 a month out here? Like one month, seven, next month. Seven some change, next month, no. <laughs> He's become known as King of the Square, but there's a whole cast of characters playing alongside him every day. Master Paul, Russian Paul, John. So you're out here on weekends too? Every day. I do not take a day off unless it's the new year. Even when it's raining, snowing, you're out here? Yeah, good shovel. And people come and they sit here in the rain and play with you? Yeah, why not? TC plays for $5 a game and gives out chess lessons to students of all ages. TC stands for Teaches Chess, because so many people come every single day just to take lessons from him. He's under attack. You still can take him. I've learned because he kept beating me over and over and over and over and over again. And eventually you learn something. <laughs> if I take your knife, I'll be aiming at your queen. It doesn't matter, I will die everywhere. Right, go out like a Klingon. Yeah. With honor! <laughs> Thanks, <laughs> the game is not complicated when I teach it. It's not. I don't make it complicated. If you teach complicated, you're going to make it complicated. I teach it fun. It's fun. There are some who say these guys are just hustlers. And maybe some of them are. But if you think TC and his buddies are, listen to what he has to say. Try it out. Try it out. You think it's a hustle? Try it out. This requires skill. Skills are up? Come on. Take a chess challenge. Give me a chess player. Take a shot. You welcome it. Even though TC loves chess, what he loves most is passing on his skills to other players and watching them as they become kings and queens of their own squares. Are you having fun or are you, or are you bored? Teach them so fast. I want to see if I can give whatever I have to them. A little bit they take away from me, keep it, that's stimulating. I do. I'm TC. You want a chess lesson? Come down to Union Square. Rally on! I have so many more questions. I have infinite more questions, but I don't want to. This chair is breaking, if not broken. It is, that, that leg. Yeah, let's, let's get it. Let's get it. Let's get it. Let's get it.